Hi guys, it's Pascal here. I hope you can hear me. My mic might be working. So I've got a few gentlemen and lady here. Um, I normally get questions online about what does it take to start a business online? Um, how much does it cost? How long is it going to take me to make money? So I've got people who, that just started basically. So I want them to share their own perspective because for me, if I answer it, somebody might think it looks easy, <laughs> but at the same time it is. So I just want to, first of all, let's introduce ourselves and you are? Currently. I'm Marie. I'm Marie. And yeah, I've been in SFM for three months now, so really, yeah, it's going okay, but it's going to get start getting better now. Yeah, I'm Tom uh, and I'm three weeks into this. Three weeks? Yeah. Wow. Three weeks. Hi there, I'm George and uh, I've been in SFM I think for about a year and a half now um, with loads of ups and downs but I think the key is to stay the path and just take small steps forward, <laughs> whatever happens. <laughs> so what is your, you coming, wh why did you join SFM? It's to improve the business that I have, but to create a second income and a passive one. Oh, you already have an existing business. What is it on? I'm a therapist. Okay. So it was to improve my marketing on that and, and get better consistency in that. SFM teaches you the marketing. That's the main reason that you... Yeah, all right. How about you? Yeah, so I'm currently in sales and I, I'm looking, oh, I'm looking uh, I guess, to find more meaning in what I do um, and to um, kind of pursue um, my passion uh, and something that isn't working for someone else's dream and working for my own. Um, so I think joining SFM, I was really keen just to understand what resources were out there um, to, to utilize in order to kind of um, get me on that journey a lot quicker and in a more credible way rather than um, kind of on a whim. So, yeah, hope, hope that helps. And George, what have you, Hi there. What have you gained from, you've been in SFM for a year now, so what have yes. you, what sort of growth have you gone through? Um, well, when you started, why did you start, okay, why did you start? And how have so, you gone some challenges that you started? When I, when I came across SFM, I was kind of at a point in my life where I was just looking for something that is more congruent to who I am and what I really want to be doing in life and where my passions lie and where my real interests lie and it wasn't what I was doing at that point and um, that's what brought me here and that's what showed me that it kind of introduced me to a vehicle to to get to to that point where I can actually explore what I'm really really interested about and um, yeah, that's this. This is the vehicle that I'm exploring. It's, it's the online marketing and the affiliate marketing specifically. So uh, that's what it's helping me with. Yeah. So um, one final question: When you were started, a lot of people struggle with how much does it cost to start a business. Um, obviously, you've been in SFM for a while now, and maybe you guys haven't really started marketing or were you thinking about your cost of starting or were you thinking about solving the problem in your life because most people don't start because they think they have to know I always say I always say very basically that if you money doesn't stop us is our if we don't know why we're doing something that's when we get stopped so for me it was more of um I had a passion to be there for my son so I was willing to do anything to make that happen so if you did any of you have that sort of mindset or is it just um me <laughs> because i'm different i look at myself very different maybe what wait oh, you got a therapy business haven't you so yeah, yeah. so yeah I, I knew there was going to be investment and it was a question of being in the the right headspace and the place to be able to do that and anything you get for free it's you're not going to really invest your time if you're not investing as well so I, I got that and it's not as much as you think you can really just start with not too much at all so what module just start are you in four. Module four nearly get nearly five yeah, yeah. so how are you finding it very interesting but really good 
good. Yeah, and it's, give, it's definitely giving me the things that I wanted. So the understanding of how to put what I already have out there and be able to use that as well further. Yeah, how about you, Tom, man? Come on. Yeah, um, well, I, in terms of... Why? Why did you... I guess the the why um, was really based around um, pursuing something that's uh, going to give me more flexibility uh, and more choice in terms of being able to go about my day in a in a different way. Uh, and I think what drew me towards the SFM was I think although Six Figure Mentors could probably be seen as a bit of a as a bit of a clickbaity title. But the, and I can understand that, but I think the reality is once you start seeing Stuart, who's the, one of the co-founders, and you start listening to the videos, they present it in a really authentic, organic way, where it's just like, you know, this might not be for everyone, and that's totally fine, and it's very much a case of what you put in is what you're going to get out. You know, it's not going to be a platform where you invest a $1,000 or whatever it is, and then you're going to be, a, you know, making $1,000 every month. You know, it's, that's, that's, a, a, that's a fairyland. And I think they are very candid and upfront about like, we have this great re resource, but it's only as good as the amount of effort and impetus that you're prepared to put into it. So. Well done, man. So thanks for bringing that up because I think Tom really nailed it there for me because I don't want to, it's what you put in is what you get out. It's not about, you can have a million dollars. If you put it into a business, the business will swallow it if you're, if you're not there to see where your money is going into. That's what it looks like for me. I hope you found some value out of it and um, is that your turn now is it did we miss yeah. you out? no so what's your why that's about it um my why i think is is pretty much what i what i said earlier is just finding something that really speaks to me to do in my life and finding something that's congruent with uh, where my heart is really uh, that was one of my biggest sort of um and um yeah, I'm, I'm still working towards that, but I've definitely seen the possibility that this and that's what kept me on track for all this time, for a year and a half. And uh, yeah, it s small steps forward, that's, I think, my, uh, my recipe, my, my suggestion, and uh, you will eventually get there. <laughs> all right. Thanks very much, guys. Thanks. I appreciate you. All right, bye, guys.